When you said yes, did you know that you would be doing some stunts? No, not, not when we first talked. As long as I could do it, I wanted to do it. She was yeah. doing more and more as the shoot went on, because I think at first we were, you know, Maybe we'll have a stunt woman do it. But I really wanted to do as much as I could. She's not going to say this, but this is a legendary Broadway dancer <laughs> with a background of really being you know, physically adept. This movie, the idea came, I'm, I'm now explaining to you the idea for you. No, but I'd, I'd, um, it's good to remind me because it's it, it came been from a busy day. <laughs> um, something that happened to your own grandmother. Did you tell her you were doing this from the beginning? I think it just kind of came up organically. I think she was excited sort of by the prospect of, you know, her something about that incident being dramatized. But I think she was also sort of uh, wrapping her head around it. I think she's still wrapping her head around it, honestly. Just the fact that the movie exists, she's seen it. And for her, the there's a line where you say, I'm Thelma Post, which is her name, um, that I didn't change for the movie. So I think that moment sort of, she comes back to a lot. It's just like, oh, it's very surreal to her. I wrote it with, with June in mind, kind of from the get. I, I, she reminds me of my grandma. I've been a longtime fan of her work, and there was just something kindred about them in my mind. They're both so resilient, but have a vulnerability to them, and there's just something about them that felt connected to me. Well, I got the script, and I loved it. And I have somebody else that reads my scripts, and she called me up and said, you've got to do this, June. So there was no question after, you know, after receiving it that I would do it if, if he still wanted me to. <laughs> we all love action movies, but like, I also love reality. And to me, nothing is um, scarier and, and more exciting than, than an action movie in real life. And part of that is always fragility. Like for, for any person to, to do anything, it's like, it's, it's when you're worried, can your body actually make it? Can this thing work? Like, it's that human mess that I think makes an action sequence the most alive and exciting. So when it came to like the choreography of those moves and all that stuff, it was awesome. But I mean, this was the main stunt woman. Yeah. <laughs> this, this was the Tom Cruise. You got to chase her a little bit. Yeah, yeah. we did it. We did light chasing. Light, 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 light chasing by these yeah. folks. You got to do some some jogging down hallways. Yeah, some semi-action jogging. Was that thrilling for you? <laughs> that was thrilling. <laughs> Our first week of filming, um, we was actually at, at Josh's real grandmother's condo. So the, the first week was um, in the real Thelma's house. Spiritually, you feel this um, connection with the actual history and the love and the material and the whole thing to be, to be there. Yeah. And it was just like really special. We like All the, the book books shelves. in the world. Yes. All the books, oh God. Yeah. You could spend days just looking at, to find out what she's reading, did read or. It was surreal it was to wonderful. be there. It was a very, because you know, I, my whole life has been, you know, I've spent time in that condo and then yeah. to sort of be there recreating something based on, you know, my grandma who's lived there my entire life, but be with all these people and, and making that there was a very, very surreal and very, very special.